Microsoft 365 app for enterprises and it is included all the Microsoft application which I require. This way you can use now genuinely use the Microsoft Office without paying any single fees or without going for any malware software. Yes, you can install the Office 365 application without paying a single fees. And yes, I am not talking about online Office 365 web application. I am talking about genuine Office 365 desktop application. I am Kostuk Sharma, AWS Certified Solution Architect and Developer, your multi-cloud DevOps guy. So without any further delay, let's get started. So let's start searching for Microsoft Developer Program. Yes, you have to search for Microsoft Developer Program, not for the Microsoft Office Free. Otherwise, that will be a malicious software for you. So now let's come to this link of developer.microsoft.com and here it is Microsoft 365 Dev Center. So you just click on it and it will take us to this link. The full link I will provide this link in the description and you can see here it is saying join the Microsoft 365 developer program today. So it, it will what it will provide it will provide you a E5 instance sandbox which you can use up to 25 user license will be provided for you for the development purposes. So what is the major highlight for this for us it is that it gives you access to all Office 365 apps which includes PowerPoint Word and all. And it also give you to access to other platforms like Power Platform Development, also give you a threat protection and you can also use Power BI. If you know all these stuff as a developer, then you can get access to these also. Also you get access to Azure Active Directory. So if you want to do a practical implementation of that, then you can do it. So in this video, we are going to only talk about this Office 365 app. So just quickly click on this join now. So then it will ask you for a Microsoft ID. Make sure to enter your Microsoft ID only just like at the rate output.com. Or if you don't have your ID, just uh, you can click on create one. Or if you want to use another ID, not your personal ID, then you can also click on this create one just like most people will do. So you can just enter your ID. Then enter your password. So this will create your Microsoft 360 development profile. So you just have to select your region. So I am in India. So let me select the India, choose your company. And in the language preference, you can choose the, your known language. So I have chosen English and just click on accept terms and conditions and then click on next. And then it will asking you questions like what is the primary focus of you as a developer. So you can click on personal projects, click on next. You can select what tools you want. So just you can click on office add-ons. Just click on it and just click on save or whatever if you want to put SharePoint framework as well. So you can put that or just click on this office add-ons and just click on save. Now we have come to this page. And uh, now it is asking that do we want to create this instant sandbox where you, everything will be set up automatically. And there is op also option of configurational sandbox where you can create from very scratch means what tools you want to include it. So it will automatically this instant sandbox will automatically create all the sample data and all. So which is not in our matter if you are just going for the office one. So just click on next. And here it is asking options to set up your Office 365 instance sandbox. 
so you can select your where you want to put your data center so just like i can put near to me so near to me is singapore option so you can see that your region cannot be changed after the sign up process then you can put your admin username then you can put the password you can confirm the password okay so the password must be 15 characters and involves some symbols and lowercase and so let me put okay, it's still not 15 So I am done this with password thing and just you can click on continue. So this will take us to our developer program dashboard page. So you can see uh, my domain is this postoximaofficial.onmicrosoft.com and I have got this renewable E5 subscription which got expired on 23 October. But as you can see it is a renewable so it will renew after it got expired automatically. So you don't have to worry about it as far as the latest information it will got renewed every single time till at least one year so i don't know how about how much that it will go but currently it is for the 91 92 days so this is the domain id you can copy and now just go to subscription and now you can sign in with the email id which we have copied so let me put that and just click on next and enter your password which you have chosen and then click on sign in i can use all these applications here as well on the browser itself but i want to install the offline application so what you can do you can just click on this install office and just click on this Office 365 per download. You can just click on Word OK. And you can see this Office, Office Setup file has got downloaded. So just click on this Open File. And after our office got installed, uh, you can just uh, go to your start button and search for the word and just click on your word file. So you can see it is asking me to sign in to set up the office. So just quickly click on sign in and this will open the activate office button. So you here you can enter your office 365 domain ID which we have copied from there. So let me paste it here. So I have entered my domain ID here and just click on next. And uh, enter your password. Click on sign in. And you can see I have been logged in. You can see all the latest options are available for me. Draw, design, layout, references, mailings and all options are available and for me. And uh, here you can see I have successfully signed in and uh, here is my user information which uh, I have signed in. Also there is a subscription information involved that is Microsoft 365 app for enterprises and it is included all the Microsoft application which I required.
So this way you can use now genuinely use the Microsoft Office without paying any single fees or without going for any malware software. And this way you can use the Microsoft 365 application for very free and it will be most genuine. So Microsoft 365 got automatic updates and it is the most updated version of Office from Microsoft. That's all in this video. See you guys in the next video. So make sure to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so you will be notified of the next video. Also, if you learned something new through this video, then don't forget to like this video. See you guys in the next video. Till then, take care.